hi guys welcome back to my channel so as you saw in the intro we're going to do some shopping some baking and we're gonna decorate my balcony for fall i came to one of my local farms just to get a couple of things i do have a small balcony so i can't put out too much but i just wanted to get a couple of mums and some pumpkins um, and yeah just kind of get the fall vibes going so i hope you enjoy this video and if you have any questions feel free to leave them below and i will get back to you as soon as i can all right can you get me i think i like that one over there And inside the barn, they have tons of haystacks. They have decor for your home, mostly outdoor decor for your backyard or your front lawn. They have different shapes and sizes of pumpkins and gourds. And then they have unique items like these little ghosts that I thought were absolutely adorable. They also have treats and desserts that are really yummy but i did not buy any because i knew i'd be doing some baking at home so if you guys want to take a screenshot right here this is the recipe that i will be making today they're called touchdown brownie cups and they are basically brownies in a cupcake form You will need two sticks of butter, melted. Half a cup of cocoa and stir until smooth. Then you will add one cup of brown sugar and half a cup of granulated sugar and stir. Then you will add your three eggs and one teaspoon of vanilla extract and then you're going to mix everything really well before adding the flour. And the last thing you will add is one cup of all-purpose flour. And if you wanted to add any nuts, you can add them at this time. My mouth was watering as I was baking and it's watering now as I'm looking back on the video. They were really good. Now this is where I put my nuts in. I waited till this step because my daughter does not like any kind of nuts in her cakes or brownies. So I do, I actually like walnuts. The recipe called for pecans, but I put in chopped walnuts and it tasted just as good. Um, and I left some out for her because, like I said, she doesn't like any in hers. And I knew I'd be giving some to my family. 
And so yeah, I made most of them with the chopped walnuts and I left a few without for my daughter. So as the brownie cups are in the oven, I'm gonna come out here and start cleaning up my balcony, putting away my summer pinwheels and giving it a good sweep. There's a lot of leaves that fall on my balcony and then I will get to decorating. Fall time is also a time where I really enjoy my balcony. I love coming out here in the mornings before work with my cup of coffee, um, with my sweater because it gets so cold up here. Even now, we're not even in October and the mornings are already really cool, which I love. Um, so yeah, I enjoy being out here in the cooler months, not so much in the summertime, not only because of the heat, but the insects. I don't do well with insects. <laughs> so I'm really looking forward to sitting out here and enjoying my pretty moms and um, yeah, just seeing the leaves fall. I just absolutely love it. And you can tell that I haven't been out here in quite some time. This table needed two cleanings because the first cleaning did not take out all of the dirt. Um, like I said, I don't really come out here during the summertime. So, and we did have a lot of rain. So I needed to give this a good, good cleaning. Where you go is where I go 
I don't need nobody else. So let me give you an overview before we have to go in and check on those brownie cups. I absolutely love the way my balcony came out, giving me all the fall vibes. And there will be more pumpkins to come. I'm just waiting on my family. We usually go pumpkin picking every year. So once we do that, there'll be more pumpkins out here. But I absolutely love the way my balcony came out. And I hope this inspires you. If you have a small space like I do, go ahead and decorate it. Make it your own. Make it festive. These brownie cups came out so good. You can definitely add some whipped cream and sprinkles or have them plain. Either way, they're delicious. They're very rich in taste. If you guys end up making this recipe, please tag me on Instagram. I would love to know if you liked it. And also let me know if you like videos like this and I will try to make more. Thank you so much for watching guys. And until next time, bye. Got me too.